You might know Eric. At work, they call him Mr. Efficiency. He can tell you how to best organize any project, the fastest way to complete it, and at the lowest cost. He never loses his cool. Everyone at work loves him. What's the matter, darling? You cannot believe the day I've had. I'm serious. The traffic going to work was terrible. And then Ellie sprained her ankle at school, so I had to pick her up in the middle of the day. The cleaning lady canceled, and the groceries melted in the back seat of the car. And to top it all off, the dog got sick to his stomach. So of course I had to call the vet. Hold on a sec. Okay, traffic's bad. Cleaning lady cancels. It's very fundamental. Eric decides to share with Heidi exactly how she could have avoided some of the problems she faced and prepare for them next time. He describes a new route to work to avoid traffic. He then goes on to tell Heidi how to keep the dog from getting into the pantry. As he begins to explain how to vacuum the house, Heidi erupts. Ugh! I have a terrible, awful, miserable, screwed up day and all you can do is tell me how to vacuum the freaking house? What is wrong with you? I'm just trying to help you. Get out. Get out. <sighs> when he's able to catch his breath, Eric wonders, why was Heidi so angry? Business skills are very different from relationship skills. To be successful in love, we must listen. We must be empathetic, caring, and considerate of our partner's concerns. We should comfort them, not criticize them when they make mistakes. Let's try this again. You won't believe the day I had. There was an accident on Maple Avenue. So I was late for work this morning and then Ellie texts me from school and she forgot her lunch and then, and I can't even remember all the awful things that happened. Oh honey, what an awful day. Anybody would be upset after a day like that. Oh. Eric continues to listen to Heidi. He offers no advice. He lets Heidi rest while he prepares dinner. With Eric's support, Heidi calms down. Problem solved. Eric is still Eric Efficiency in his office, but he has learned to be empathetic Eric at home. Taking these steps have turned this power struggle into a power snuggle. Visit powersnuggles.com. Power Snuggles, your path to vibrant and lasting love by John and Beverly Meyerson.